What's up everyone, Lion Roar here, and today I'm gonna to show you how to transfer Ethereum from either Coinbase or Coinbase Pro to MetaMask so that you can easily use it to trade for NFTs or use it in NFT games like Gods Unchained. All right, so if you're getting into the world of NFTs or NFT gaming like with Gods Unchained, then you're going to need a digital wallet like what MetaMask provides. Not only does MetaMask keep your Ethereum safe, but you're going to need it if you want to interact with Immutable X, which is where a number of different NFTs for games or just art are sold minus the gas fees. Now, if you know anything about crypto, Ethereum gas fees can be very high. So looking for network solutions like with Immutable X is vital. So you need this MetaMask wallet in order to be able to do that. But of course, you're going to need Ethereum before you can transfer it to the wallet. So you need an account like Coinbase, which is an exchange where you can buy Ethereum. Now, I've provided a link in the description of this video where you can download Coinbase and get $10 worth of Bitcoin for free after you make $100 worth of trades. And of course, once you get that $10 worth of Bitcoin, you can immediately sell it for Ethereum, which then you can transfer it to your MetaMask wallet to use for NFTs or in your favorite NFT game like Gods Unchained. I'll also put a link in the description of this video for Gods Unchained if you're curious about that, want to try that out, use my referral code as well. So let's take a look at Coinbase here because you need to open a Coinbase account or a Coinbase Pro account, either one is fine, and it really just depends on your trading style. For more casual people, you're probably going to want Coinbase, uh, and this is where you can buy some Ethereum, and you can see it's right here, you just click buy and get as much Ethereum as you want and then you need to transfer it to your MetaMask wallet, which is here. So of course you also need to sign up for a MetaMask account. If you've already signed up for a game like Gods Unchained, then uh, you are already going to have probably created this because you need to have it in order to be able to collect the cards that come as part of the game. Now notice that in your account, there's going to be an address right here which is where you're going to send your Ethereum to. It's really important you get this all right, but a lot of these companies have been doing a good job at allowing you just to copy to your clipboard exactly the address as it is so that you make sure that your Ethereum makes it where it's supposed to go. Now you can go back to Coinbase, click on Ethereum, which you just bought, then click on Wallet, and Coinbase makes it really easy because you don't have to try and figure out how many Ethereum you're actually sending. You can just type in the dollar amount that you would like to send, like let's say $100. And you can send that to the address, which I'm going to paste here, that we just copied from MetaMask. And when I click off of it, you can see it verifies this is an F address. So we know it is actually the account we want to send this to. And you can put an optional message in here if you want to, and then click continue, and it will send the Ethereum to your MetaMask account. Now, some of you might run into a security issue, and if you don't, I actually suggest that you enable the security feature, and that's just so that hackers and scammers can't get into your account and liquidate everything without you noticing. So if it says that the address cannot be verified because it's not whitelisted, or if you want to enable whitelisting, you go into your profile settings and then click on allow list. And in here, allow listing is checked off for me, which means that any wallet that's entered into the account must go through a 48 hour waiting period. So if it's saying that your uh, address is not verified, that's why. Click address. Uh, then you're going to click on the currency that we're using, which is Ethereum. Then we're gonna give this uh, a nickname, Ethereum Wallet, and then you paste the address that we just got from MetaMask and click Add Address. And then you have to wait a couple of days before you can actually use this, but this is good because it's an extra layer of security. Once you add that and then you go send the Ethereum from Coinbase to your MetaMask Wallet, you should see that appear here then. Now, I have Coinbase Pro as well, and I've already whitelisted my address in here. So I am going to just click withdraw. And then I'm going to click ETH. 
And then here's my uh, crypto address that I've already whitelisted. And I'm going to pick an amount I want to send. And I know that I want to send 0.14 ETH to my account. You can see there are gas fees for doing this, but once you get it into your wallet and you're using Immutable X, then there are no fees for that. So this does save you a lot of money doing this. Then you click withdraw. And then you should have an authenticator app on your phone for an extra layer of security as well. So I have that and I'm gonna type in a code that can only be used this one time so don't try using that because it won't work. <laughs> it changes every about five seconds or so. And then it's going to start the withdrawal process, sending that Ethereum to my MetaMask wallet. And you can see that the Ethereum that I have sent has arrived and now it's able to be used in Immutable X. All right, so if you enjoy videos like this and you find it useful, I'd appreciate it if you would like it. Subscribe and hit that bell notification so you know when I drop new videos or go live. And I will catch you in the next one.